Well, hello there. I'm Ed Phillips. And I'm Lavinia Nixon. And we've got a great trip up for grabs this week to the Canadian Rockies. And do not despair if there are any damsels in distress. Our trusty Mountie Scotty is on hand to take care of things. Feeling safe. The game is on. Welcome to Temptation. Welcome to you at home. More on that fantastic prize. Make sure you're watching Temptation next week, of course, for your chance to win this luxury scenic tours holiday we've been talking about to the Canadian Rockies. Every night next week. Every night. Let's take a look at it. There's one trip for each state. That's five incredible holidays to give away. This amazing experience is for 13 days. It includes accommodation at the finest luxury Fairmont hotels, and you'll experience the natural beauty of the Canadian Rockies with a train tour. It's on the famous Rocky Mountaineer. Oh. You'll explore the picture postcard scenery of Lake Louise. It's all courtesy of Scenic Tours, the ultimate touring experience of Canada. Do the maths. There's something like 25 trips to be won, so make sure you're watching all next week, and of course tonight, and good luck to you at home. It's going to be fun, isn't it? Now, welcome back to our champ, who's sitting pretty, maybe playing for the holiday in the next day or two. How are you, Stephen? Very well, thanks, Ed. How are you? It's good. Well, we made you suffer through doing some impressions and impersonations last night. <laughs> Have you there. got any good. more? No. Okay. okay. <laughs> no, Fair enough. go away. That's the right answer, but we've got a couple of challenges coming your way, Stephen. Here they are. Our first challenger was a finalist in the Triple J Raw Comedy Competition two years in a row. She loves Madonna and all things 80s. From Cooparoo, Queensland, welcome Jill Raby Gardner. Hope she likes Mounties too. Hi, Jill. <laughs> Our second challenger once helped Kylie Minogue with her bags at the airport. Should he be so lucky tonight? From Hillside, Victoria, welcome Dan O'Connell. G'day, Dan. Hi, Ed. You met Kylie. I, I suppose there's no privacy laws. Where was she travelling to? I'm not sure where she was going, but... Um, you have a little chat, did you, when you were at the airport? It wasn't so much of a chat. It was more of an embarrassing episode where I helped her tie some tags to her baggage and manage to hit myself in the face with the, <gasps> the tags at the time, so... Nice one. Very cool in front oh, of a yeah, star yeah. celebrity. I'm sure she was impressed. <laughs> Good work. Welcome to the show. Good luck to you tonight. And Jill, now, look, we didn't make Stephen do impressions, but you sing karaoke. You love it. I do. Should I love it. torture yeah. you and make you do that for oh, us? Or no. No? Oh, no. Oh, no. That's terrifying. Oh, hey, yeah, she might be good. <laughs> oh, no, but no one wants to sing. No one sings as badly as you. Oh, All right, oh, then. No, I'm pretty okay. bad. Okay, karaoke without music is just singing loudly to yourself, isn't it? Okay, Thank Jill, you. we won't make you suffer, but good Thank luck. Thank you. Good luck on the show. Welcome Thanks. to everybody. Let's get rolling, shall we? Yeah, we'll kick it off with $20 starting money. Good luck. Cool heads, fast hands. You go hum to yourself. <laughs> we'll speak to you soon. Here we go, everybody, into round one. From the footwear that supposedly typified them, shady Queensland businessmen of the 1980s were known as the What Brigade. Stephen? The White Shoe Brigade? Yeah, the champs away. Just a Girl and Don't Speak were hits off the... Jill? No Doubt? Yes, the album Tragic Kingdom. What gait of a horse between a trot and a gallop is an anagram... Stephen? Canter. Yes, an anagram of trance. Good work by the champ early. Here's 20 seconds, so come out sprinting, everybody. Your time starts now. What is op short for in op shop? Stephen. Opportunity. Yes, to issue a challenge is to throw down the what? Stephen. Gauntlet. Yes, starring Marilyn Monroe is the 1957 movie The Prince and the What? Stephen. Showgirl. Yes, what term denotes five children born at one birth? Stephen. Quintuplets. Yes, a common Australian bird is the willy what? Dan. Wagtail. Wagtail is right on the buzzer. Good to hear from you as well. Champ out flying though. Stephen, on $50, you're 25 clear of Jill and Dan. It's temptation vault time to get a look inside its doors. Score yourself between a dollar and $5,000. I reckon that's pretty tempting. It cost you 10 to play. Interested? Uh, I'm going to say no. You're going to say no. You've yep. never been further ahead of a challenger in your short stay here at temptation. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm going to no? say no. Don't want the money? Okay. Press on with the questions and you still lead. The Greeks defeated the Persians in which 490 BC battle that gives its name to a type of foot race? Stephen? Marathon. Marathon will do. You oh, yeah, could have done that temptation yeah, vault, you know. So. Which fish related to the herring is a basic ingredient of a Caesar salad? Jill. Anchovy. Anchovy will do us as well. First look at our fame game board. We've got a possible $10 up for grabs here. Who am I? Born in Wales in 1957, I first met my performing partner in the late 70s at London's Central School of Speech and Drama, and we joined up... Dan. Tom Jones? Not Tom Jones. We joined up again in 1980 as cast members at the Comic Strip, a London comedy club. TV appearances followed, especially in Comic Strip Productions and the Girls on Top series, which I co-wrote, and from 1987, we co-wrote and co-starred in our own series. Jill. 
Dawn French. Good get, Jill, you're right. Dawn French it is, married to Lenny Henry, another fabulous comedian. Stephen, comedy writer, maybe you should have known that. But Jill, it's your pick from our nine famous faces tonight. Lavinia, who are they? From the afternoon show Hot Sauce, it's Dave Whitehill. Sally Ann Deckett, Mornings with Kerry Ann. Heath Ledger, whose movie Lords of Dogtown opens next week. Joe Hall from National 9 News in Melbourne. Another Aussie making it on the international stage, Anthony LaPuglia. Genevieve Morris from Comedy Inc. McLeod's Daughters and Brett Tucker. Entertainment Tonight's Mary Hart. And cooking up a storm, Jeff Jantz. Jill, how about you sing out the name of one you like? <laughs> I'm just going to say it, Ed. Okay, go for it. If that's okay. I'm going to take Mary Hart from E.T. Good luck with Mary from Entertainment Tonight. The Turbo. Oh, well, that'll be exciting when we get back into the second round. The next three questions when we come back will be worth double $10 apiece. But that's round one done and dusted. The champ leads back with round two right after this. Thursday, an all-new night on nine. I'm feeling a little bit nervous. Temptation Vault Money, he's playing to win tonight. So here we go into round two. Equal to 200 milligrams and comprising 100 points is which unit of weight for gemstones? Jill. Carrot. A carrot will do, up to 40. Which Palomino horse featured in the film Westerns, starring Roy Rogers and Dale Evans? Jill. Trigger. On a bit of a roll, you're right. Also known by a three-letter abbreviation, is which organisation representing more than 27,000 doctors in Australia? Stephen. The AMA. The Australian Medical Association gets you further into the lead with a bit of breathing space. Stephen, you are 15 clear of Jill. Here's a chance to be tempted right now with Lavinia. The Alessi Factory of Industrial Design is renowned for capturing the spirit of the times in its gorgeous homewares. These seven modern bar accessories include the Anna G Corkscrew and Jasper Morrison Wine Cooler. Incredibly innovative and highly collectible, they're $1,649, but for tonight's temptation, they're $10 from Alessi. Oh, aren't they cool? Like that. What's that little one? You them anyway. Oh, <laughs> Okay, you gave us nothing in that temptation <laughs> vault. Because only we but give you something. <laughs> Redeem yourself, Stephen, but $10. Um, they're very stylish, uh, but I don't know where I'd put them. Um, On I the ends of bottles? <laughs> mm, just, <laughs> it's not that hard. Um, right, gotcha. Um, no, um, they're very nice, but uh, no thank Still you. Still playing to win? Yes, Going sir. once, twice, not interested. Close up shop, let's oh, go home. All right. right. Keep your lead, though. Three questions ahead, and round two rolls on. In an election, a ballot paper which is invalid because it's been... Jill? Donkey. ...is incorrectly completed is called a what? An informal vote we needed there. In Greek mythology, built for King Minos of Crete by Didolus was which place with many confusing paths and... Stephen? The labyrinth. Yes, and passageways. Fifteen dollars now in pay for this uh, round two fame game, Who Am I? Born in LA in 1943, I had early formal music lessons and also learnt from my uncle, an honoured Hollywood composer. A contract writer for Metro Music, I churned out pop songs like I Think It's Going to Rain Today for Judy Collins and Mama Told Me Not To Come, a hit for Three Dog Night. My 1968 self-titled debut album sold poorly, as did the follow-up, 12 songs. After Sail Away and Good Old Boys, 1977 saw my most commercially successful album, Little Criminals, with the often misunderstood hit song, Short People. Stephen. Randy Newman. Randy Newman it is. Randall Stewart Newman gets you a look at our famous faces. All right. It's your choice, champ. Who will it be? Joe Hall, please. Good luck with Joe Hall from National 9 News. $10, Stephen. Oh, a handy $10. Need I say that? Would have paid for the look inside the temptation vault. I know. Here's some more questions for you, everyone. In Napoleon's day, Europe's chief port for importing British goods, Gothenburg, is the second largest city of which country? No takers. Sweden, anybody? That would have got the money. Featuring on a new Royal Bank of Scotland £5 note is a portrait of which great US golfer who recently played... Dan. Jack Nicholas. Good to hear from you. They put Jack on a Scottish five-pounder. In the Bible, engraved on stone tablets and given to Moses... Dan. Ten Commandments. You're right, on a bit of a roll as well. On my go, got another 20 seconds up on the clock, players. It starts now. A former Wallabies captain is Nick Farhu. Dan. Jones. Yes. What's starting with T is a self-propelled underwater missile? Stephen. Torpedo. Yes. The winner of the 99 Melbourne Cup was Rogan Watt. Dan. Josh. Yes. Which mammal starting with B also means pester? Stephen. Beaver. Badger. The most important or prominent position is called pride of what? Dan. Aaron. 
place on the buzzer we needed. Never mind, good roll from you in that uh, quick time. And Stephen, our champ, still sailing along pretty well. $80, you're on, you're clear of Jill and Dan. But for how long? We'll find out with round three just around the corner. Saturday, two strangers. Live here and let you mess with my head for a whole month. Yeah. Have only one month to turn their lives around. It must be November. Nelson, it doesn't get much sweeter than this. Keanu Reeves and Oscar winner Charlize Theron. Sweet November, 7.30 Saturday on 9. With cross-track all-wheel drive, ESP and hill descent control, all standard and from under $41,000. The new 190 kilowatt V6 Holden Adventure. It's pure Aussie animal. Welcome to Allianz Cover Story. When your car's off the road, your main priority is to get it back on. How fast that happens usually depends on your insurance company. Allianz is one of the few insurers that allows you to choose your own repairer. Or use an Allianz network repairer and they'll take care of the whole process and get you back on the road fast. You can also reduce your premium if you're a safe driver or if there are no drivers under 30. So talk to one of their insurance specialists. They can help you over the phone with quotes and explain all your insurance options. Because getting your car back on the road is their top priority too. Call Allianz today on 131000 for a quote on your car insurance. Why do some things stay timeless? Like a precious piece of jewellery. Or a classic sports car. They don't make things like that anymore, people might say. But ever so rarely, it happens. When aesthetics and functionality meet in perfect balance. Introducing the new Astra Coupe. With four airbags and ABS standard, the Astra Coupe provides you with incredible confidence. But in the end, the real confidence comes from having a great body. The sexy new Astra Coupe. It's a confidence thing. Saturday night at the movies. Oh, you don't look like a bodyguard. Kevin Costner and Whitney Houston in The Bodyguard, Saturday on 9. Welcome back to Temptation. We've got a good game on our hands. Our champ may be playing for the hallowed $100 mark. On track so far, Stephen. Here we go into round three. In his early years, signing his name Ruiz Blasco, was which great Spanish artist who died in 1973? Stephen? Picasso? It was. Pablo Picasso, Ruiz Blasco. Not as exciting a name, is it? Which early Christian martyr who, during the Middle Ages, became an ideal of martial valour and selflessness is the patron saint of England? Stephen? St George. St George gets you to 90. Boxers weighing in between 48 and 51 kilograms compete in which of the 11 Olympic weight divisions, beginning with F? Stephen? Flyweight? Flyweight is right. He's quick as me, Jill. I saw you just leaning on the buzzer. Not quick enough. But you're in the driving position, Stephen. $95 you have to spend. I reckon we can tempt you this time round with Lavinia. This ain't just a pretty plasma. This is Australia's first plasma with a built-in high-definition tuner, which means crystal clear pictures and cinema-like sound. And most importantly, with no set-top box, there's never a loss of signal. Only one power lead and one remote control. It's $4,499, or tune in tonight for $15 from LG Electronics. Just $15 from Oscar TV. We're begging you, Stephen. Oh, Take the man. TV. Let's just wrap it and put it in your car and hit your buzzer. Oh, man. $50 clear you are of Jill. Dan, just a question further back. Oh. oh How can I not? <laughs> yes, it's gone. Finally. <laughs> that felt like agony. Back to 80. Still lead the game, though. Here come more questions. Which 1997 Gillian Armstrong film was adapted from a Booker Prize winning novel by Peter Carey? Stephen? Oscar and Lucinda. Okay, that'll do us. Though sessions may be held elsewhere, which Dutch city is the seat of the International Court of Justice? How about The Hague, everybody? All right, further questions to see out round three. Dedicated in 1922 in Washington, D.C., was the memorial to which 19th century U.S. president? Stephen. Lincoln. 
having a good game, champ. Up to 90, and it's our final fame game question. $25 up for grabs now, along with the wild card. So, who am I? Born in Jamaica in 1967, I moved to Ontario in 1981 to live with my father. In high school, I ran the 100-metre sprint in just... Dan. Marion Jones? Not Marion Jones. Ran the 100 metre sprint in just 10.65 seconds, but my first love was basketball. After receiving a diploma in business administration, I started my own investment, consulting and marketing firm. As a member of the Canadian track team for the 93 World Champs, I met coach Dan Pfaff, who overhauled my technique so that at the 1995 Worlds, I won the 100 metres and then the 1996 Olympic 100 metres in 9.84 seconds to become the world's fastest man. And with a first name Donovan and a surname Jill. Smith. Not Donovan Smith. I am Donovan who? Stephen. Donovan Bailey. Donovan Bailey gets the champ, the final crucial pick. All right, Stephen. Got all the clues and now you get the final pick of the board. Um, Genevieve Morris, please. Genevieve Morris, your comedy cohort. That takes you past the $100 mark, Stephen. Over a hundred. All right, and the rest of the money goes begging. Lavinia, where was the big bucks? The wild card was with Jeff Jantz and Dave Whitehill had the $25. That's where the big 25 was. Did you know it at home? Well, we've got a big lead for our champ so far. Can Jill and Dan make a bit of a comeback? We've got the fast money round after this. Hello again, Peter Hitchener. St Kilda coach Grant Thomas has apologised for his outburst against umpires after the AFL threatened to charge him with conduct unbecoming. The Prime Minister expects the remaining 51% of Telstra to be sold off next year. Authorities have killed a four metre crocodile believed to have taken a man in far north Queensland. And infectious diseases experts call for calm over a hospital superbug. Fine tomorrow and a top of 20 degrees. Melbourne's number one, National Nine News with Peter Hitchener. Tomorrow and today we're on location in Melbourne's Burke Street Mall. And she's not just a pretty face, Mrs Murdoch Sarah O'Hare talks about life and love. For most of us, our home and contents are our most valuable asset. But many insurance policies don't include the features you really need, or only offer them at an extra cost. Unlike some, Australian Pensioners Insurance Agency include the features important to you, like flood cover and storm damage to gates and fences. Plus, when you insure both your home and contents, you receive a genuine 10% discount. Call 132555 for home and contents insurance with the extras included. Understanding, not just insurance. <laughs> In Fruitopia, it's all about family. And much like the Inuits rubbing noses, they have their own unique way of showing affection. It's all one big happy family here. So lovable, who knows why, eh? Discover it in Fruitopia. McCain wood fire style pizza. An authentic wood fire taste straight from your oven. Introducing the three litre electronic direct injection turbo diesel Toyota Hilux. The most powerful diesel in its class. With a huge 343 newton metres of torque double wishbone front suspension and Toyota's legendary four-wheel drive. It's ready for anything off-road. Get in or get out of the way. When Kate discovers more than expected, the question is, what do they really know about Rob? McLeod's next on Channel 9. Temptation is brought to you by a very familiar face. Australian Pensioners Insurance Agency. Understanding, not just insurance. Welcome back to Temptation, everybody. Final round, it's fast money time. Here we go, the champ sitting pretty, but 60 seconds worth of questions. I have them here. It's up on the clock right now, and your time starts now. An NGO is a non-what organisation? Stephen. Government. Yes, the individual pursuit and kilometre time trial are events in which sport? 
Jill. Biathlon. Cycling. Starting with Jay, what's the biggest cat of the Americas? Stephen. Jaguar? Yes. The namesake of an English philosopher was English painter Francis Who? Jill. Bacon. Yes. Which monarch officially ascended the throne of Monaco in July this year? Jill. Prince Rainier. Albert. The most southerly point of mainland Australia is Wilson's what? Stephen. Promontory. Yes. Savage Garden sang the hit single, Truly Madly What? Jill. Deeply. Yes. By, in and from. Or which part of speech starting with P? Stephen. Prepositions. Yes. What basic currency unit is common to Singapore and New Zealand? Dan. The dollar. Yes. Sent to which neighbouring planet in 1975 were two Viking space probes? Dan. Jupiter. Mars. To which geometric figure does the famous Pythagoras theorem relate? Stephen. Triangles. Triangle. Very impressive win to the champ. 130 tonight. Gets him over the line comfortably. He's very good, Stephen. He is very good. Well done. Good game from everybody, but it's hard to press a champ when he's on fire like that. Absolutely. Now, Dan and Jill, I hope you've both had a fantastic time here at Temptation. Unfortunately, no cash and prizes, though. But it, did you have fun? Absolutely. It was great. That's hey, the good. Hard to get a word in around our champ. But thanks for being on the show tonight, guys. Got this lovely consolation prize as a souvenir of your night on Temptation. To remember your time at Temptation, we have a 10 gram bar of solid gold for you both. It's guaranteed 99.99% pure. This gift is from the Perth Mint. Stephen, monster win. Thank you. What a fair champ. That's a big one. Getting over the yeah. century mark easily. Yeah. And as a second night champ, you got this now to recline on. A stunning white leather Gainesville lounge suite has to be the ultimate indulgence for your home. The luxury of leather is combined with innovative design to create this quality furniture. Designed to suit your needs, the lounge converts from a low back design by day to a comfy high back at night. Teamed with a modular entertainment unit, it's a $17,500 temptation from Gainesville. Ah, uh, how comfy is this? Not bad. Very comfy indeed. You're looking far too relaxed. It's just lounge ah, by that sort yeah. of kind of fireplace thing. <laughs> there. All right, keep it going. Another win tomorrow night. Bit of bling. No one does it better than Versace. Striking and sophisticated, this opulent timepiece from the design house of Versace was created for a man who appreciates life's luxuries. Swiss made to the highest of standards, the stainless steel case is set with 68 dazzling diamonds. This temptation is $19,000 from Versace timepieces. Sparkling diamonds, nice, isn't it? Really? All right, that looms. Tomorrow is your temptation. However, get on a bit of a roll. By Friday, you could be jetting away to Canada. Stephen, night four, and you'll be playing for this luxury 13-day holiday in the Canadian Rockies. It's over $35,000 from Scenic Tours, the ultimate touring experience of Canada. I'd like to see another outfit as well. That'd be great. <laughs> What's your hat? Oh, no, 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 this no, one or that one? <laughs> I might see you in the pink frock. That'd be great. Mm. Five in a row, Stephen gets you starting up your own brand new car. Let's have a look. This is the just-released XC70 SE. This all-wheel drive wagon with a powerful turbo engine caters equally for the rough stuff and the need for intelligent luxury. Uncompromising safety features, design flexibility and a luxury interior with child booster cushions deliver a wagon designed for the adventurous family and all the equipment that goes with them. Priced at $56,950 plus on-road costs. Volvo for life. Lovely car. I'm bringing something off the shoulder for you to bring out the cheekbones. Thank you very much. Get on an extended roll. Six nights, Cece, taking away all these prizes, and by night seven, the ultimate temptation. Let's take a look, because in fact, all that glitters is gold. Stephen, here's something to really make you smile. After seven nights, we'll give you half a million dollars in solid gold. Springs a smile to your face. <laughs> yes, it does. Big pile of gold. All right, champ. Simple choice tonight, the furniture or come back for the flashy Versace watch, $19,000 worth all to play for tomorrow night. A simple 10 seconds is all we need from you for your decision. <laughs> Champ, I think you've got plenty of unfinished business to attend to here. That's right, I want to come back. Good for you. All right, Stephen, we'll return tomorrow night now. Everything to play for. Passing on the furniture, looking ahead to that watch tomorrow night from Versace. $19,000 worth. You got a grand in your cash account last night by playing 10 in a row. I think we can do better tonight, so let's have another go, shall we? 10 in a row. It works like this. You'll have 60 seconds to correctly answer as many questions in a row as you can. For each correct answer, we put more money in your cash account. For 10 in a row, we'll reach $100,000. One wrong along the way, we reset back to zero and start again. So, one final choice from you, Stephen. Which of these five different sets of questions will it be? 
Uh, number three, please. Three, you say. All right, then. 60 seconds up on the clock. I have it here now. Good luck. Your time starts now. Which vowel is not contained in the word pronunciation? E. Yes. The River Po flows through which European country? Italy. Yes. Which spiny finned fish is also a roost for a bird? Perch. Perch. On just out of time. Johnny Depp stars in Pirates of the Caribbean, The Curse of the What? Black Pearl. Yes. Which Scandinavian country borders Germany? Austria. Denmark. The Melbourne Cup is run over how many metres? 3,200. Yes. Referring to a computer keyboard, tab is short for what? Tabulate. Tabulator. Rebuilt several times has been London's famous what lane theatre? Drury. Yes. The Olympic Games for what year were cancelled due to World War I? 1920? 1916. Venezuela has a coastline on which sea? Pass. Caribbean. Rhinoplasty is cosmetic surgery for which part of the body? The nose. Yes. On the buzzer. We've got a grand in there, but that's the last night's $1,000. Oh, wow. Up and down, got a bit Ooh. of a high, a bit of a low, but Ooh. there we go. We've got $2,000 to try and cash in tomorrow night. Also yep. playing for that fantastic Versace watch, $19,000 worth. And with a huge win tonight, I think this champ's got oh. some good prospects. <laughs> There's so much to come back for tomorrow night. It'll be very exciting. Rest up, champ. We'll see you on deck tomorrow. We'll see you same time tomorrow night as well, and we will tempt you again. Are you going to pull a hamstring or something? No, I'm <laughs> Good job. Stay late.